playing for its second straight CIFL title this coming Sunday. Marion, Ohio is the place. Four o'clock is the time. And Bill, obviously, going back to back, what would it mean for this franchise to win back to back championships and bring that trophy home? Well, I might have to bring a prop. The last time I was here, Gary, if you remember, I brought a prop up. Yes. Okay, I'd like to bring a second one. And the other thing is, uh, I'm not hopping mad over the hops, but we're <laughs> hopping ready to go and get over to uh, Marion, Ohio this, uh, this Sunday morning. We'll take off, and we're excited about being there. And it would mean a great deal personally for me, but more important, I think, for Erie to have a franchise that's able to come and say, hey, we have been able to uh, win two titles in a row. Anytime you get a chance to do that, get to the game is one thing, winning it is even more important. Yeah, it almost legitimizes the first one because you're able oh, yeah. to come back and, and win the second one. Uh, so you, you guys split during the regular season. Uh, you know, you won here, they won at their place. So obviously it's at their place. What kind of obstacles do you have to overcome in order to bring home the championship, Bill? Well, again, it's going to be a very, very physical contest. Uh, Saginaw is a, a good opponent, but this is by far and away our, our most competitive team we've played against now when we were in the SIFL, again, we have a major, major uh, competition with them. It's not the fact that the guys don't respect one another. It's a very heated contest. And again, going into their house, anytime uh, uh, you go to an away game, it's very tough to win. And in this title game, more so. Yeah, and that's, and that's what you want. I mean, to, to be the best, you want to beat the best. So oh, that, absolutely. You would certainly earn it if you win it there, right? Oh, absolutely. Uh, again, our guys are ready to go. We're at full strength. We're, uh, the, when we went to Marion before, we were not. I feel comfortable with where we're at. Uh, the addition of John D'Angelo, uh, Alfonso Hoggard back with us has really added both on the defensive side and offensive side. I'm very, very pleased, and I give a lot of credit to our coaches and players where we're at and what we're doing. Got about 30 seconds left. Uh, this has turned out to be, uh, from top to bottom, from yourself on down, a model franchise in indoor football. I mean, people look at this franchise and say, this is the way it's supposed to be. Well, uh, I thank you for giving me those accolades. There's a lot of people behind the scenes uh, that are helping to make this possible. Again, we're just a very, very small organization. Again, uh, doing some things very efficiently, but we're excited about uh, Going to Marion, bringing one back, Gary. All right. Good luck to you, Bill. Thank you. And we'll see you on the Sunday Sports Blitz right before the game this coming Sunday as well. And we'll be back with more right after this. Stay with us.